On the 4th of October 2018, barely five months into the regime of Comrade Prince Williams Akboreha and his team, the entire rank and file members of the Union gathered again in Abuja to celebrate the 40th year anniversary of the Nigerian Union of Petroleum and Natural Gas Workers, Nupeng. It was at this auspicious gathering of the veterans and current members where the history and struggles of the Union were being relieved and examined that it was unanimously resolved that the Union needed a new and befitting secretariat to meet emerging and evolving administrative and operational demands of the Union. The national president of Nupeng, Comrade Prince Williams Akboreha, true to his nature, accepted the challenge and made a promise to give the Union a befitting national secretariat. Historically, the Union secretariat was first situated at number 50A Kanu Crescent, Ebutemeta, Lagos, and from there, it was moved to number 2, Gemina to Burai Moklos, Surulere, in March 1980. All these were rented apartments with all their shortcomings and inconveniences. Immediately on the return of the Union from the proscription imposed on the Union by the Abacha regime, following the political struggle of June 12, the new leadership, then under Comrade Birisi Beawe as president and Comrade Frank Ovie Kokori as general secretary, the union made bold and landmark move by acquiring a property for the union, which was renovated and commissioned as the National Secretariat of the Union in March 2000. The secretariat was named Nupeng House at number 9 Jibowu Street, Yaba, Lagos. The Union Secretariat remained at number 9 Jibou Street for 18 years, but as time went by and because it was an old building that was renovated, the building started showing some signs of weakness and could not adequately cater for the Union's administrative and operational needs. This necessitated the mandate made to the new team of the president, Comrade Prince Williams Akborea, by both former and current members at the historic 40th anniversary celebration of the Union. Like all other leaders in its history, who is on a mission to create indelible marks on the sands of time and committed in building a Union that can withstand the test of time and a pride to all former and current members of Nupeng and all other oil and gas workers globally, he came up with very ambitious and daring decision to embark on the demolition of the Nupeng house and commence construction of a new eight-story structure to be appropriately named and called the Nupeng Tower. This, his team agreed with him, will serve as the befitting National Secretariat for members of the Nigerian Union of Petroleum and Natural Gas Workers. The tender for the construction was immediately made public, but with stringent conditions so as to ward off unserious and incompetent contractors. At the end of the rigorous but very transparent exercise, the contract for the construction of the Nupeng Tower was awarded to Messrs Telesol Limited based on its track records, technical competence and competitive cost of construction. The groundbreaking and foundation-laying ceremony took place in August 2020 and was graced by the leaders of Nigeria's oil and gas industry, Lagos State Government and the leadership plus rank and file members of the union. Immediately after the groundbreaking ceremony, the contractor was mobilized to site to complete the carcass of the 8th floor tower with block works and plastering within 12 calendar months and the whole world saw the bulldozers swung into action with the entire building of former Nupeng House being demolished to give way for the birth of new and highly modern Nupeng Tower and the site gave way for construction work 
that refused to stop. It is noteworthy to mention that everyone that passes through the entire Yaba area marvel at the resilience and determination of Prince William Aboreha and his team. The structure, even as it stands today, can be seen tens of kilometers away. The entire skyline of Lagos mainland has been totally dwarfed by the imposing presence of Nupeng Towers. COVID-19 pandemic and the unending devaluation of Naira have not been able to frustrate the work. As the saying goes, no one can stop a man on a clear mission. It is very clear that Comrade Prince William Aporea is a man on a mission to build a union all members of the union will be proud of. The construction work is already at a very advanced stage as the building is currently at the 6th floor while it is expected to reach the 8th and final floor by December 2021. It is going to be an ultra-modern masterpiece when completed with offices, lounge, conference halls, auditorium, gym, guest apartments and a penthouse. It is a whole complex and it will be the first of its kind amongst trade union organization secretariats in Nigeria. The whole project points out to the collective will of the leadership, the support of the National Executive Council members and members of the union. So stand up for the champions, for the champions, stand up, stand up. Stand up